Hey everybody, what's going on? Walker here with episode number 69 of my Thumbcraft Let's Play series. Today! Alright, so last episode we went through a bunch of stuff that I had done, and then we did some uh, infusions on ourselves. Well, today we're going to go through, and I'm going to try and do every last one of them. I have, over here, a box. Inside the box, and some in my inventory, I have... Every single item I need to do all of these infusions. I spent a little bit of time collecting all of them just for you guys. Um, and yes, we're going to have to redo the Awakened Blood and the, um, what's the other one we did? The Silverwood Heart one. But right now I have this all set up. I already have my effigy in there. He's already turned into um, a uh, body without a soul. Okay. And I have set up around it the for the tumor, the warped tumor. That will, oh, I thought I heard something. That will help uh, reduce a lot of our warp that we currently have. And then some soap or an arcane spa will get rid of the rest of it. And yeah, I'm going to do that eventually. I just quite haven't quite gotten to it yet. Actually, I don't really remember... Uh, I don't remember where it, uh, there it is. I need, a, no, I only need that one. That's actually really super cheap. It's the soap and the bath salts that sucks. Though now I should be able to make those really easy. Not so much that, that sucks. Okay, anyway, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to smack that because I already have uh, everything I need around it. Now, this is a very high infusion, but I should. I actually put some more stuff below the the vat. It should be okay. If not, then I guess this episode's getting cut short real fast. Let's take a look and see. Well, no lightning. That's a good thing. Now, unless... I'm, oh, something hit me. Oh, something hit me again. Maybe there is some lightning effects. Now, unless I'm mistaken, the more enchantments or infusions you put on a body, the more, uh, tend to be much more costly. I think the more you put on, the more it uh, becomes unstable. But I could be wrong. But we're going to go in reverse order. We're going to start with the very highs and then move our way down until we get to the moderates. That way, if there is a, uh, a stacking effect of instability, it won't be too awful bad for us. Oh, there goes one. Got that just in time. That almost was bad. Well, there you go. That one how has a warp tumor. Ooh, yeah, he lost. That's the other thing. Um, I'm going to actually, you know, I'm not going to do what I said I'm going to do. I'm going to put the ones I want on first, and then I'll move on to the ones that maybe I don't really care about. Because, uh, and in, uh, um, unlike our moderate infusions, which only took not even half a heart for both of them, well, half a heart for both of them, uh, this one took a full two, so that's a full four damage to that particular effigy, and I do not think there's a way to repair it. Uh, so what we're going to do instead of what I was just going to do is we're going to skip right to uh, Silverwood Heart. Put that back on. Oh, I hope I have enough of everything. I don't think I have enough of everything. Uh, Metallum. I don't have any more Ordo. Sano. I know I have plenty of. I can get more if I need it. 32, 32, and 16. Permutatio. Oh, that used up all my viniculum. I noticed while I was digging that I saw I found uh, holes for more 
uh, pipes on the bottom. That's kind of cool. And if that's true, if you can put pipes up through those in the bottom, my next run through, I'm going to put this on a big old platform and have the pipes coming out uh, somewhere else. So, uh, well, let's just go... Let's see, I know I need Sana. So I can put that right there. The Viniculum vin can come right back down here. Hordo, Hordo, Hordo. I don't think I have, I have 12 Ordo. Well, that sucks. I got plenty of Permatatio though. Oh, well, it's about time you guys showed up while I was doing a video. Now I have to find them. Where is you? You up here? It's gonna be real cramped quarters if you are. Nope. Now he mu they must all be up in the workshop. Oh, I'm never gonna get used to this new setup. There's one. Okay. Are there any others? Usually they come in. They've been coming in twos and threes. Although I might not be getting so much because I have the Silverwood Heart now. And it reduces the potency. Well, I don't see him. So let's get back to work. Uh, we can put that right there. And I just need 32 Ordo. So, um... Goodness, let's just, how many Ordo Shards do I have? Not a whole heck of a lot. Oh, man. And there's really not a whole heck of a lot in regular Thomcraft and uh, uh, vanilla Minecraft that give a good amount of Ordo. If I had Railcraft installed, I could use core. I could use Corrid Stone. That gives you one Ordo and one Lux. It's actually really, really cool. Here we go. Get all four of those. That'll give me at least eight. I guess give me. I got. Oh, I have eighty-six. Three. Give me thirty of those. Give me magic that I don't need. Put the corpus back. I got so much of the magic ascension now, I just, I have no use for it whatsoever. I want to make a super body. Uh, get that in there and throw that into my furnace. I should probably check to see how the, the coal is in that thing. Oh, there is no coal in it. That would be why nothing's happening. Oh, I put the freaking tainted goo in my inventory, didn't I? Get that out of there before I get stupid uh, taint sickness. Alrighty, well, that went smoothly, didn't it? Well, I can still set up the table while I'm waiting for stuff to come out. So this one I needed, the two silver wood logs, um, that and that, if I remember right. Yeah, I'll definitely be like making this way different than what I have it right now. I think there's a way that I could do it so that it'd be really cool. Right, that's enough charcoal to get it going. Of course, oh, I could have just taken it from there. What are you holding, buddy? Oh, I know what you're holding. Oh, shoot. Because I took that bucket of permutatio, all the permutatio beans are coming over. 
Um, that was right there, right? I don't need any more of that right now. Come on over. I got tons of it right there. All right, let me... Now you're gonna bring over beans. Get rid of the lemus. Yeah, quarried stone from Railcraft, I think it is, has tons and tons and tons and tons of uh, ordo if you if you mine it all out. I mean, one vein of that stuff will set you up for quite some time. Ugh, all I need is that ordo. Everything else is secondary to it. Man, I didn't want to spend... Why did I... Oh, I was going to replace that one. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. How much? 38. That should be enough. I need 32 if I remember right. We'll put that one uh, right there. And let's give that a good smack. Let's take a look inside and see. Oh yeah, it took half on that one. Let's just watch it and see. Wish I could see the... Two, one, zero... See, it's doing the self-infusions just fine, but it got caught up on the creature infusions a couple of times for me. Hmm. And that's a what? A high? So it looks like the highs take half, the very highs take four, the moderates take nothing. Oh, that took two. And it's still going, too. There he is. Alright, now I got the tumor and the silverwood heart on there. Um, I wonder if there is a way to repair it. I know the nutrient mix is supposed to do something. Oh, no, that's just for growing clones. All right, uh, we're going to do the diamond one next. Because the other ones I can get from other things. There is uh, the underwater breathing. Once I get my uh, Icorium set done, I'll have underwater breathing just fine. Um, wall climbing, I don't really, really care about. Uh, the, uh, Awakened Blood is nice. Uh, what was this one? That was, oops. Don't want that there. That was, uh, the, oh, Quicksilver Limbs. Which does what again? Oh, movement speed and jump height are both increased. I mean, it's not like I really need that, right? But the diamond one, I think, stacks. So let's do that next. It's, uh, diamond, diamond blocks, diamond, diamond blocks, diamond. And it's uh, a hat. I don't know which goes which, which goes where. Boots, tunic, and pants on the bottom. Doesn't really make sense to me. I would put uh, boots on the bottom, but that's okay. Now then, what do you need? I think I saw more Ordo involved. Nope, I need humanist. Tutaman and Vitreus. I hope I got enough of all of these. Yeah, sorry for making this episode pretty much just last episode, but with stronger infusions. But I, I didn't feel that I really uh, had gotten the full self-infusion experience, what with me running around... Uh, 
finding other stuff and showing what I had done. Ah, oh, son of a biscuit. Ah, no, no, no. I don't know why there's Mezes there. What are you doing? Oh, more Ordo. Thank you. Um. Uh, nope. I need... The chameleon skin I really don't really give a name about. Let's just make it 30 just in case. Just need 16. Just need 16, Bubby. It's plenty for now. Oh, yeah. did I put the corpus back? Yes, I did. I have alienus, I think, here. Yep. Tons and tons and tons of essential. I gave up keeping it in order. Don't really need to now that the. Uh, Locust does it for me, but what? What you got in your hands? T What's that? Is that more vitreous? Um, let's see. What don't I use any of? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Here, I have so much metallum, it's coming out my ears. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where's that? Just get rid of that. That's all I wanted, right there. That's all I needed. That much. Wee. And then that. And then that. And then, this one's gonna take a little longer, and I hope it actually works. I'm surprised that with the infusions I'm pl plugging on here, it's not uh, increasing it like it does with, say, runic shielding. I really would think that it would do something like that and be mean to us. So now we're down three. We've still got uh, seven left to go. This one... This one seems to be doing okay. And yeah, the, um... I can't remember which one. One of the, the creature infusions... I think it's the Lunar Wolf. Will, it will, uh, as long as the moon is out, will recharge my wand for me. And I can have a guard panther if I really wanted to. Alrighty. There's that one. Oh, that didn't take any off. Nice. We're just going to keep going. And uh, what else can I throw on there? Let's do the awakened blood now. Because that one is a nice one to have. Uh, where did it go? There's the, the brain. Though I really, really, really hate potion effect bubbles. Uh, permanent potion effect bubbles. Um, I just do. What did I need for this one? Cognito, Sano, and Victus. A full jar's worth of Victus. Uh, I have just enough Cognito. Which I will put right there. I shouldn't need humanus anymore. Whoa, I went up. I meant to go down. Dummy me. Okay, put that there. Uh, we'll take that. Oh, that's... shoot. Oh, that's famous. The famous right back. Uh, and the Victus will bring over here. Thunk. Oh! I love it. It's like a, a Victus filling jug. All I needed was 32 sun, alright? Yep. 
I like these infusions because they're really fast. I mean, it's not like some of the ones that take uh, some of the item ones where it's like uh, 12 items and 120 some odd essentia. It's very quick. Oops, the Cognados should stay there, right? These are pretty darn quick ones. And I'm kind of impressed with that. Alright, so we got the diamond skin there, we got the silverwood heart, we have the uh, tumor. Not sure if we should throw anything else on there or if we should just call it good with that. There. Ah, uh, you know, I gathered all the crap I needed for the chameleon skin, and I just, I can't see me ever using it. I just, mm, oops, yeah, that doesn't help us any, does it? I don't know. I just don't see me using it anytime soon. So maybe I'll just throw all that stuff in a box for now. Oh, by the way, you know how I said how I was complaining about how I didn't have the um, water breathing or speed potions, right? Well, I was I was actually going through all of them, and I had the two speed potions right there. They were staring me right in the face, and then I had two water breathing potions uh, that I could add redstone to to extend their duration to make them what they're supposed to be. Oh God, I thought it had stopped for a second. Yay! Oh my god, we can still do more. Look at that. What else can we do? Oh, you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to put the synth skin on. Uh, definitely going to put that one on. The synth skin uh, fills your hunger bar in sunlight. It doesn't fill saturation, but it fills hunger. Uh, so as long as I'm in the light... My hunger bar will never go down, and I want to see how that will uh, hold up against uh, unnatural hunger. So it's vines, leaves, sapling. It's vines, leaves, which remember you can grab leaves using a uh, shears. Same with the vines, shears. Uh, and then any flower, and it can be any kind of sapling and any kind of leaves. And this one actually is going to be a little more involved. 32 Famous, 32 Herba, 16 Humanus, and 32 Lux. Where is that? Did I? Oh yeah, I put it back downstairs. I said, oh, I don't need this anymore. Uh, I'm, s I'm, I'm, I'm right intelligent sometimes. All right, let's go get uh, the other stuff so that we don't have to break those stupid things. All right, I need Herba. I need Lux, Lux, Lux. Lux is empty. What the heck? Um. Lux. Herba, Lux. You know it would have been nice if this infusion used Arbor um, as well. Maybe Arbor instead of Famous or Arbor instead of Lux. I don't know. Or Arbor instead of Humanus. Uh, because almost nothing uses Arbor. And yeah, I can cook it down, but. I, it's just, it feels like it's a useless thing. It's kind of like, um, mm, like the poison one. Hardly anything uses the poison. Um, or bestia. Hardly anything uses bestia. All right, we got to wait for him to fill that jar up. So let's just go get the other ones. Put down while we wait. Uh, we'll put that down. 
We. We're gonna put. We're gonna put the Victus over on the jar. The uh, this here. Uh, cause that's the easiest way to get it filled. Put that there. No more jars in my inventory. Are you almost done? Almost done. What else did I need? Oh, I needed more. How much more do I need? Please tell me no more. 16. I have 18. That should be good. Should be. We'll see. Come on. A little bit more, dude. A little bit more. If you'd stop taking them one at a time, you'd be all set. I wish I could set it up. Actually, I probably could. A golem fetter. With... Well, because I have four Olympics, that really wouldn't work out very well. Yeah, I know, you want to go over there, but you can't. Alright, this will be the last infusion. And then I'll kill myself, get in my new body, and then we'll go check it out. And a humanness. So, let's hit that and see what happens. It's still not doing anything, though. It's kind of nice. So remember, we gotta put our soul beacon on top before we go and try and kill ourselves. Uh, or bad things will happen. Namely, we'll die. And we won't go back into our body. Our new body. Our new strong body. Our body of... Ridiculous number of infusions. So the ones I'm not putting on right now, uh... Let's get away from stuff so that I can hear myself. Chameleon skin, uh, act like invisibility. Uh, amphibious breath lets you breathe underwater, and I think gives you perfect sight, too. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Maybe not. Uh, morphic fingers... Oh, I really wanted to put this one on there. Morphic fingers uh, lets you activate a crafting bench without... Anything. You hit M and it opens up a, an, ar um, an arcane workbench. Pretty cool. Uh, I'm not going to do it, though, because I don't have very many minutes left. And I'm not going to go to 40 minutes like I did last episode. Alright. Soul Beacon set. Now then, let's go downstairs and empty our pockets of all of our valuables. Put you there. Because I am not running back to go get all of this crap. There. Oh, I run so slowly. Oh, so slowly. Yes. Yes, paving stones of travel. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Where's the batty? The bat was the one that killed me the fastest. It was kind of nice. I wonder if my XP is still lying around down over here. No, I don't see it anywhere. I mean, I could punch a pigman and that'll do me in real fast. Let's do that. I'm just going to try and get away from my portal in case they retain their aggro effect on me for whatever dumb reason. It's happened before to me. Hi. Wee! 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 Oh my god! What a nightmare! Oh my god! I have lots of cool stuff on me! I wish it would show everything, because now I don't know if I still have everything or not. Um, ow, I forgot my levitator wasn't under that one. That's what happens when you've got slow fall or no fall damage whatsoever or anything like that. I can take 
everything. Does the B menu still work? Yes. Good. I keep coming in and hitting that to go into this, but you can also just hit B for bobble. Um, all right. See. So I'm going to have to just put up with pink bubbles around me. But I should also... Um, how can I get myself to run out of food real fast? Well, if I hit damage myself, that'll do it. Let's see. Ah, oh, my, my runic shielding is taking most of the fall damage. I don't want to fall from too high, because then I could die. I don't have a new body yet. All right. And I should probably get inside. Look at that. I have regen. Come on. Do it. I jump a lot. There we go. Okay. Jump a little bit more. Okay. Let's go outside before the sun goes down and see if this works. Oh, my God. It does. How sweet is that? Yeah, it definitely would not be able to keep up with, uh, and yet the saturation is very low. It definitely would not be able to keep up without natural hunger. Um, but in a pinch, if I'm like way out and I don't have one of my stacks of delicious, delicious steak, uh, in a pinch... That would help a lot. All right. The one other thing that I really care about. Let's check to see. Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh, man. I keep forgetting. Ah. Well, up there in the upper left. Look at that. It was full with a cracked brain. Now look at it. It's almost empty. Dude. That was... Wow. Wow. That works better than soap and everything. Holy criminy. For as cheap as that was, I mean, it was a pain in the butt to go and get the uh, uh, Tainted Essentia there. The I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, we're not going to go to 40 minutes again in this episode. I am going to say this, this whole week is going to be kind of um, fairly simple things for me to do because I did start my uh, new job on Monday and... Um, I haven't quite got back into a normal sleep schedule. I haven't quite gotten back into a a regular work schedule. So I'm still getting used to it. You guys just love getting out. But uh, I'm still getting used to it. So it, it, if it seems like this week have, has been a lot of almost throwaway episodes, that would be the reason why. Sorry, it'll get better once I get into a routine. Um, where are you going? No, no. Stop. Ah, oh, son of a biscuit. He'll stop in a little bit. He's got way too good a range. He shouldn't have a range that well. Anyway, guys, that's going to be this episode for it. We have made ourselves a monster body with high durability, super resistance, regeneration, a warp tumor to take care of all of that stuff for us, um, food regen, and uh, goodness gracious me, this should keep us safe for a very long time running. Next episode tomorrow, I will start working on, it was requested I start working on the blood alchemy stuff. I've been wanting to do it for a very long time. I think I will start working on that next episode uh, because it does sound really awesome. And the next time I go into the under, uh, Outer Lands, I'm bringing one of these things with me. Because if it does what I think it will do, that will be extremely useful for me. So that'll be tomorrow's episode, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, a like down below would be much appreciated. Remember to subscribe to my channel for Monday through Thursday Thorncraft videos. Uh, and as always, check you guys later.